You photograph the eyes, we just superimpose this chart over the photo, and then we can tell, we can look at disease. When people meet me, every time I explain what I do, they ask me this, they always ask me this one question. Can iridology detect illness? First of all, let's look at the word iridology, okay? Iridology is, is commonly known as people that are iridologists, right? The science is commonly known as the science of iridology. So can iridology affect illness? Definitely. I've been doing iridology and studied it and practiced it since 1976. I've seen over 38,000 people using iridology and our modern cameras. What we, do, what we do, we've got the most modern cameras designed to photograph the iris. That's what iridology means, the science of reading the iris. Now, so we understand clearly what it is. When you look at the person's eyes, the first thing you see is in the center is a pupil. All right? The pupil is the center part of the eye, and then the pupil sits in the actual iris, which is the colored part of the eye. And then that the iris and the pupil sit in the sclera, which is the whites of the eyes. Apparently, from the studies I've done, iris comes from the Egyptian meaning rainbow. Now, I've seen black eyes, I've seen very dark eyes, I've seen brown eyes, I've seen hazel eyes, I've seen light brown eyes, I've seen blue eyes, I've seen green eyes, and I've seen a mixture of any of those, right? But in every case, in every case, we can detect illness, whether you've got brown eyes or blue eyes or red eyes, right? We can, we can actually um, detect illness that way. So the chart we use is a chart that's been put together after 700,000 people were checked out by this very famous doctor called Dr. Bernard Jensen in California. Right? Dr. Bernard Jensen looked after 700,000 people in his long practice of 50 odd years and he helped many, many people using the science of iridology. And this, this chart was put together after many, many other photos were taken. And this chart is what we use to we photograph the eyes, but then superimpose this chart over the photo. And then we can tell, we can look at disease, right, in the lungs here, in the lungs here and here, in the brain area, left brain and right brain. We can look at your kidneys, your right kidney and your left kidney. We can look at your back problem. Okay, here it is there. We can see your back problem here. We can see your thyroid. We can see your ascending colon and your, and your transverse colon and the rest and the small intestines. We can see the rest of the transverse colon and the descending colon and the sigmoid. We can see all of those. We can see, like I said, the kidneys. We can see, we can see also the, the thyroid here the left thyroid, the right thyroid, the function, how your brain's functioning, the right brain, the left brain, very, very, very powerful chart, right? And so that is superimposed on your actual photo that we take using this powerful camera, and then we can help you with what is detecting the disease, right? Now, in particular, we've done, we've, we know there's 11 body systems, in particular, when we look at your eyes, we look very carefully at your digestive system, all right? In the digestive system, we, we can detect your, the, the uh, pancreas here, which sits beyond the stomach, all right? There's your liver and gallbladder. That's your right liver, that's your left liver, that's the gallbladder sitting in there. This is, this is the esophagus, and this is your, your stomach, the duodenum, and also then 25 feet of small intestines. Yes, ascending colon, the transverse colon, the descending colon, and out. That, we can see all of that in iridology. We can see all of that in assessing your eyes, right? And that will give us very good information about 
the state of your colon and your digestive system and how much toxicity you've got. And from that assessment, we can then give you guidance using the very best supplements in the world about how we can heal your body. Now, one of the books, one of the many books we've studied is this book here, the book of iridology, about 700 pages, volume two. That was written by Dr. Bernard Jensen, who was a doctor of chiropractic, a medical doctor, a PhD, and also, and also a nutritionist. And in this book, he writes, he writes about many, many hundreds of cases that he healed with, and look at the size of it, about seven to 800 pages. Now, we've studied that book from, we've, we've studied, we've got three books like that. One's worn out. We're now, we're now to the second book and the third book, and that's what we use. So this book is brilliant. We use a lot of information in that book on how to help you, okay? So, when you go to this QR code, access this QR code, you can request a 15-minute consultation uh, on the phone, and then we can explain how we can help you. Now, also, while you're at the QR code, you can, you can access this booklet. It's free. What your eyes can reveal about your health, about 15, 16 pages. And in this one, the benefits of having an iridology consultation. Remember, the 15 minutes is no charge. We give you the ability to talk to us, find out how clever and intelligent we are about it, and then we can guide you on how to create your best health you can now if you like this video make the comments and request these books and then make a phone call to us and request a consultation thank you